Okay, we have a 2000 Dodge Caravan here with a stuck door. And it is actually my caravan. I have to figure out how to get this open. The handle works and the door lock works. So that the electric door lock is working, but the door won't open. Okay, first thing to do is to remove the rear seats and get them out of the way. Alright, the seats are removed. Now we've got to remove the top panel. Top panel? Okay. Removing the top panel. Just pulling on it with my fingers. Like that. And it comes right out. There is some gooey stuff here. It's a little gooey. But there's the panel. Okay, there's one bolt here we have to remove. It's a Phillips head. Using just an ordinary Phillips head screwdriver. There it is. Also removing one screw inside the ashtray. Just pull the ashtray out. Go in and remove this one Phillips head. Watch on behind you. It may not pop completely out of there. There's a cover here over a rubber stop that you have to remove. You just pull that off with your fingers. Pulling the bottom panel off just takes some persuasion. It's quite a few pegs. You just have to be patient and pull on it, but it will eventually come out. There it is. Wow. Now we just have to remove this rubber covering that's over everything. And it's just kind of stuck on there. Try not to tear it up. And there it is. Removing the bolts on the bottom roller assembly in the front of the door. All right, so we kick the front part of the door panel and then kick the rear part of the door panel several times and it popped open. Now that we got the door open, we need to lubricate the gas filler lock right here and the main door lock. Make sure that those will work. A lot of dust got on them. Dirt from the road. And uh, here is the pin from the gas that goes into the gas filler lock. Probably need to lubricate that too and lubricate this door latch. It's just all the road dust that got it stuck. Here's what the gas filler pin looks like, and I think it was the thing that was holding our door from opening. The latch was stuck on it because the pin is bent. And uh, so we'll probably have to straighten that, lube it, and, and maybe it'll be alright.